Hey guys, one more. I have two. And we're still kind of just exploring around. Uh, we've got a big ass gun on our uh, boat now, which is totally awesome and fine by me. Now there is like a little bit of a trap here. It's a tr it's a tarp. Yeah, I know. I kind of want to go up there though, because there's a door there. We have to go there. I don't know how though. Uh, I think we can just make it on there maybe. I don't know. See if I can do that. Nope, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm trying to think here. Uh, see, I've done that last time where I, I kind of just hopped onto it from here, but uh, last time it uh, it made me go underwater. So there we go. Let's see. Oh, this is an awesome room they come from, just out of nowhere. Let's just keep going around. Oh, apparently I was stopped by an invisible wall, so, uh, we were never supposed to, it was never meant to be. Okay, we'll just go this way. The way that we're actually supposed to. Uh-oh. No, no. I, I don't like missiles. Still epic now, so. Oh, he's dead. Nothing else here, really, though. Oh, oh, there's a there's a thing there. Let's go there. More crates. They're so half lifey. <laughs> That's one way you deal with these guys. Oh, but there's a way to get up there. We'll have to find a way to get up. Uh, probably the same way I went up before. By basically just going into the water and taking a bit of damage. This is going nasty. Oh, there's nothing here. There was some bullets here, I guess, but... Oh, I don't know what that is. Alright. I'm assuming that there's nothing really here. And my assumptions are totally correct. And now we're loading. Okay. Uh... I, I haven't found one of those, those stashes that I haven't seen in a while, like, that I've never, I've never been to. Because those ones are pretty sick, and I like, I like getting those. It's exploration. Damn it. There we go. Finally he's dead. And we can get on top there. No, we cannot. We need to be a little bit closer. <clears throat> All these places I've just never been to, so it's kind of... Oh, wait, there's more of those sewer things. We, we found that interesting cave before. And that was, like, the coolest thing I've ever done. Well, no, not ever done, but, you know. Alright, let's just go here. Briefly. Uh, they're both closed. And there's nothing here. Oh, that's so disappointing. Oh, we're back here, really. <clears throat> I'll just kill those guys again, because now I have the actual... I have the means. No, you... You jerks. Oh. Ow. <laughs> that hurt. Uh, can we go over there? No. Because there looks like there's a... Uh, no. Okay. No obvious ways to get up, so we're just going to see. Oh, that hurt. 
Oh, can take him out. Uh, oh, there's a box up there, I think. Is that a box? No, it's not. Okay, I think that's it. <laughs> it's nice if you take this thing out, because that... Oh, now he's no threat. And, oh, what's this? It's exploration time. Places I've never been to. Oh, man. We have so much of this ammo, really? Didn't this hold, like, 36 shots, not 18? I don't know. Okay, well, there's no point in that, so... It's... Turn around and... Oh, this is not good. How did I do this? And... Oh, sweet. <laughs> it lies perfectly on, on the top. <laughs> oh, what? Uh... That was, uh... That could have been really bad. I don't think up there, but there's, um... The G-Man. <laughs> the G-Man. And going into those random places. Oh, really? So... He's up to his old tricks. Uh, I'm not really going to go into there with this, so... Too many tires. A nice, a nice van. It's like the mystery machine. Yeah, cool stuff. Okay, we're going to just toss a nice grenade down. Oh wow, now he's, uh, severed. Lamar! I think I found Lamar. Uh, would there be... anything of interest around here? Uh... No, I don't think so. Kinda cool. <laughs> Alright, we're done with that. Back to the airboat. Oh, how I love the airboat. It's, you know, the car, the car sucks. The airboat kicks ass, because it's just, you just glide around. It's the way it can, it's just the way it handles. Whoa. And, hopefully that's all of them. We nothing here. <laughs> oh, really? Is that really necessary? I mean, I could just go right through it. It's like, oh no, wall of fire. Whatever will I do? And they're gonna just chuck out, chuck, chuck down things here. So, uh, doesn't really do anything. Oh, that's what the wall of fire was for. Okay. Yeah, it's like a game. We. Not more. I think I've had enough of that. Really? Does that even seem like a good idea just to just come down when I have a big gun on this thing now? The nerve of some people. <laughs> All of that. Can we do a loop? We oh, no, we can't. Oh, come on, Valve. That would have been totally sweet, if you know it. Hey, there's stuff in here. Cool. Alright, uh, we're gonna have to explore the ships and stuff, but not before we, uh, deal with this stuff. Alright, we got that guy. And they're both gone. And now it's exploration time. But okay, that's where we have to go in the end. There's a nice jump to do it. And I think I may have missed stuff in here. So we're going to just go in here briefly and not see anything. So. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh, nothing here. Okay. I guess it's a. Uh, damn it, I want to go on that ship. 
Oh, okay, that was weird. Uh, hmm. Oh yeah, we can make it on. One of these days is gonna be something on here, and I'm gonna be like, told you guys so. Oh, I kinda wanna go in there now. Uh, don't think that's gonna happen. Alright, your boat. <laughs> that was an awkward way to get back on. The sideways airboat. Alright, um, here we need to solve another puzzle. What could the puzzle be? Other than me just finding random boxes. We go in here? Yeah, I really like these ships. They never hold anything, but I like them. Uh, well, obviously you cannot do anything with those strings. <coughs> and it is what you do. Basically, every every puzzle in Half Life can be can be solved by brute force. It's just incredible. Let's go over here, actually, because there's uh, nothing here, and I want to show you guys that. Just in case you ever want to say, you know, I wonder if there's something there. Now you have your answer. There isn't. Alright, and now we go off the faithful jump. And we're done. Okay. Man, we really haven't seen any caches for a while. Oh, wait, there's something that way, but we'll see what's this way. There's nothing. That looks like a hole, but it's not a hole. Okay. Alright, and now we have finally clear water, which means we're probably getting to the to the end to the to the end of the canal. Oh man. Ugh, man, I've just been recording this all on the weekend. And is there anything here? Nope. So we'll now go through here. Whee! Oh look, a big field. I wonder if this means anything. Probably not. There, it is completely safe. <laughs> All right. Uh, we'll just open some of these things. And another one. I think that's it. And venture forth for B. Or, I don't know. This is going to be the damn helicopter again. I mean, I haven't kicked this ass enough yet, so it's... It, well, it's gotten a few, you know, upgrades. I think they've realized. Oh, there's crap down here. Oh, that's enough. You really? I like any game that explores... Uh, that, that, that rewards exploration like that. They should even put it into places where they don't think they could reach, and like see see how how the players will will try and make it reach it. And I'm just I don't know I'm going through all these. We can't do a horn button. Nope. But I do have a button which makes me jump up and down. Yeah. Hydraulic airboat. Dun -dun -dun -dun. All right. Well, that does it for that. <clears throat> it's me and you. That's right. So, he looks the same, but he's had a few upgrades. Which is something like, you know, carpet bombing. Alright, and then we'll just, you know, hang out here. Because you do have plenty of opportunities to do this kind of stuff. <laughs> Not a very difficult boss, except, you know, now I'm flying around, so... What do I know? He's just doing it over and over again. Just to learn his lesson. And he's dead. Revenge for what? He never did anything. Right. 
Uh, I guess that's where the pilot was. If there was a pilot. Maybe it was automated. I don't know. Well, that was uh, a easy boss. <laughs> Nothing much more to say when you've done him enough. Oh, look, I had to heal three points of my health. It's gotta suck to be a helicopter pilot. Uh, I don't know. There's like a um, couple boxes here. But, you know, that's not really particularly interesting boxes. Because it's just like, yeah, I, I'm pretty much maxed everything out, so... I don't think there's much more exploration to do here. So this, there's this thing here. That doesn't really seem to do much. Okay. Another one of these gates. The atmosphere is something I absolutely love. It's really sad though, that, you know what? These still look like... I'll, I'll be honest with you, um, the way from old games to new games, the newer games don't seem to have much other than like, oh look, it's HDR, you have a little bit of shine. Uh, and that's virtually it. Like, I think we've pretty much hit the apex of what how realistic graphics can look, because, oh, look, they they have a few more pimples on their face or something, you know. It's really not that uh, interesting anymore. Oh, wait, look. Uh, oh, 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 oh. That looks interesting. Uh, I don't want to go in here. Okay. Oh, God. What the hell? What? We remember the free man. We are called Terminus. We huh? have survived worse across the ages. Whatever. <laughs> Dude, I've never been here. <laughs> it's insane. There is no distance between us. No false veils of time or space may intervene. This is pretty awesome. We see you still in Black Mesa. Clearly we see you in the Nihilus chamber. What? We bear witness to the bright eternity of the Nihilus demise. You leap, you fall, we see you flash between the back. For a brief time you so there's apparently achievement for this. Communion of the Vortex. Okay, well he doesn't say much else. Alright, we gotta run all the way back, and I'm probably not gonna make it. No. Okay, that's probably not enough health. Oh well. <laughs> I'll just load it back up. That was insanely cool though. Um, I, uh, it's one of those things where I'm exploring for once and I've never found some, like, all of this. That was, that was pretty neat. What is that one called, anyways? It is... The... Uh... Yeah, I'm finding Lambda Caches. Okay, got the airboat. Where's the latest one? Discover the singing in Vorti- wow. <laughs> Was this always in the game, or did they add this like recently? I don't know. They made so many changes to this. Alright, I guess I can go up here, I don't know. Or not. Uh, let's, let's just check around here a little bit more. Okay, so we know that there's stuff here. Uh, I guess not. <laughs> that was that was pretty awesome. The singing board again. <laughs> I, I never would have thought to check there if it wasn't for the fact that there's like all these achievements now to find these hidden caches. Never would have thought. No, damn it. Want to bring the airboat up? There we go. And go airboat. 
they will never see this coming. Anymore? Nope. I, I don't blame them. Oh. Uh, bloody. There we go. Yep, one more. Oh, nothing here, so let's just go get... Oh, it's a stash. That's cool. Well, now I will never have health problems again. Well, you know me. <laughs> it's on hard mode, and I'm still like, you know... I have like everything. Alright, let's go with the airboat. Airboat ho! No. Uh, this is awkward. Okay. Now we got out. Uh, can we go down here? Yes, yes we can. Go across this bridge. <laughs> they will never see us coming. Uh, I think that's it. I guess I gotta go down here. Wow, that did an amazing job with keeping the elevator on me, actually, because usually you just fall right off them. And that opens up. So let's let's do that, because we couldn't get, make it up here before the helicopter was around. And uh, do you want? Let the, let the thing down. Alright, uh, we're going to probably have to go all the way back. Oh no, this is good enough. We... And now, in true Gordon Freeman style, well, I'll, I will hit the bit barrel and then we will go across this thing. Yeah! <laughs> that was that was awesome. It's the it's the finale for the airboat. Unfortunately, there's no more airboating to be done. <sighs> All right. I like that down. <clears throat> and we got a D something. What are we in Russia now? Over really here. Uh, nope, nope. All right, I think we're done with that part. And the lambda symbol. Oh, I oh you just have to find the signs, I guess. Oh, this is not a cache. It's, I just found the symbol. Uh, something. Oh, let's just go down here. Nothing here, obviously. Oh, forgot sprint and flashlight use the same thing. Which could can be irritating sometimes, but really, who cares? You've got something. Okay, it's it's human. Hello. You're take it easy you. in there. You're safe now. You'll have to forgive the scanning process. We can't take any chances. <laughs> Doctor Freeman. Gordon Freeman. Is that you? You've made it here this quickly. Well, Eli is going to be amazed, not to mention relieved. I'm Dr. Mossman, Dr. Judith Mossman. I've been hearing about you since long before the Black Mesa incident. Oh, Black Mesa. I do so envy you working with Eli and Dr. Clyde when they are at the top of their field. Ah, there we go. You can come through now. I'll take you down to Eli right away. You would never forgive me if I kept you waiting. <laughs> <laughs> you see, it puts actually the gun down, because it's like, you know... You aren't too important for me to kill everything use mode. The extra help around here. We've covered a lot of ground in the last few months, but things would go so much faster if we had more people with your training. We're closing in on a reliable local teleport technology. Something the Combine still hasn't mastered. Eli thinks their portals are string-based. 
similar to our Kalabi Yao model, but they fail to factor in the dark energy equations. They can tunnel through from their universe, but once they're here, they're dependent on local transportation. If they knew what we were doing with entanglement. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Listen to me, I sound like a postdoc. I, I, I'm just so excited to think that we'll finally have the chance to work together. Where was I? Oh, yes. Dr. Kleiner compressed the Zen relay far beyond anything he imagined the Black Mesa. We figured out how to use Zen as an unexpressed axis. Effectively, a dimensional slingshot, so we can swing around the border world and come back to the local space without having to pass through. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, I oh, see. Here's a Eli now. All right, good. Keep right on. Eli, look who I found in the airlock. Gordon Freeman. <laughs> Let me get a look at you, man. My God, you haven't changed one iota. How do you do it? Now, let's see. The last time I saw you, I sent you up for help after the resonance cascade. <laughs> I never thought it would take you this long to get back to me. Welcome to the lab, anyway. It's not Black Mesa, but it served us well enough. It's going to be a lot more like Black Mesa with Gordon here to help. Right you are. MIT graduates are few and far between these days. We'll get you out of that hazard suit and back into your lab coat where you belong. Let me just finish up some work and I'll see what I can dig up. Dr. Freeman, it's been a real honor. I'm looking forward to working together. Feel free to look around. Yeah, nothing does anything. We're still not sure what that does. Alex brings in the strangest thing. You remember my wife, Ozian, don't you? That picture and Alex were all I managed to carry out of Black Mesa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Her surrenders. Oh, Gordon! The Vortigon said you were here. I can't believe you made it so quickly on foot. I believe he broke your record, honey. Well, he earned it. I guess you proved you can handle yourself out there. There's nothing Gordon can't handle, with the possible exception of you. Dad, please. Uh... <laughs> See these new things? Portal storms. Seven hour war ends in combine victory. Take a look at this, Gordon. One of these <coughs> from the original Half Life. That's always great. Dr. Breen, he's the administrator of this whole vile business now. He ended the Seven Hours War by managing Earth's surrender. The Combine rewarded him with power. Oh, yes, wonderful. Oh, nothing here. Anything in here? Oh, hey. Oh, Dr. Freeman, you should stay with Eli. Go on, I'll rejoin you shortly. What are you looking at? I'm on to you. The Vortigaunts relieved me so I could come see Gordon. Anyway, I should be in here working on the portal. I have the repairs well in hand. Someone misjudged the capacity of the Combine Thyristor. <laughs> Are you blaming me? No, not at all. It was a calculation error, not a mechanical problem. Then maybe you should let me do the calculations next time, as well as installing it. Alex, really? Sometimes I think you deliberately misunderstand me. <clears throat> Alex, why don't you take Gordon along and give him some practice with the gravity gun? Sure. Come on, Gordon. Let's go have some fun. The zero-point energy field manipulator is not a toy, Alex. Ugh, let's get out of here. <laughs> and, but we're gonna have to end this, so tomorrow we will play with the, uh, gun. See you guys later.